Step two is to create a white cross with matched edges and center pieces. Remember the white tiles are my edges. Action one is to look at the middle layer on my front face. So here's my up face and my front face. And I'm looking for these to match. They do not match here. So what I need to do is to turn my up face and it can be right or left until they match. So all I needed was one turn to have them match. They happen to be orange, just like I see here. Action two tells me to take my front face and turn it two times. One, two, and now I have my two orange down below, just like I see here. What I'm looking for is the white cross. I can peek at my down face, and there I see I'm starting to build it. Now I want to repeat that process for the remaining sides. So I come here, I'm looking for the blue edge piece. I simply rotate my up face, either to the left or to the right, until I have a match between the edge piece and the center piece. Move to, I move to action two, which is two turns to the right of my front face. Again, taking a peek that I'm building my white cross. Rotate again. This time I am looking for the red edge piece. There it is. So once I have my edge piece and center piece lined up, two turns of my front face, one, two, and I can rotate to the last one that matches. And again, one, two. Now I look on the bottom. I have a lot of white tiles facing me, but what I'm focused on is to look for this white cross that you can see here down on the bottom of page six, or you can see up here. So indeed, I have my white cross, and I wanna double check that I have the edge and center pieces matching on each face. So I can rotate around and see that I have successfully completed step two and I'm ready to move on to step three.